Juan, I was out world. It's Coach Cool, Fight Strategic MMA. Um, what I want to talk about today is building on your base. When I say building on your base, I mean whatever your base fight style is. Whatever martial art you learn first, that's your base fight style. For me, it was wrestling. So in wrestling, you know, we're taught to, um, just a bad boom, taught to keep whatever our lead leg is, our um, strong leg, keep that forward. And um, in wrestling, you know, it's uh, about pinning. It's not uh, really a combat sport, it's a grapple sport. So we don't have to worry about any strikes, but you know, we can keep our hands here, hand fight, come up where your clinch is, and two on ones, all that good stuff. So for me, when I was starting to learn MMA, boom, I come here, this is where I feel comfortable at. So for my wrestling stance, it's pretty good. I can still drop low, change my level, get into my side if I need to. But for boxing, this, this, is, uh, this is not the right stance. My right hand is my strong hand, so in boxing I would be an orthodox fighter, crawl with your jab, and come with your power hand, power cross. But like I say, my base stance was wrestling, my base art was wrestling. So I'm way more comfortable here with my power hand forward, which is the JKD principle, and, and this is it, boom. I come here, I can still jab, cross, do whatever, drop low in my shot, come from a Muay Thai kick and all that. Okay, so with with wrestling, that's that's uh, wrestling only handles one range of fighting. That's the grappling range. Um, it kind of does go into trapping and clinching range a little bit, um, but mostly it's just grappling. So let's say your base style is Muay Thai. Muay Thai is a good art because it covers three ranges of fighting. It covers kicking range, punching range, and trapping range with the top plumb, bringing knees up, elbows, and all that. So if your base style is Muay Thai, you would really only have to work on the um, a grappling art get you a BJJ or a Sambo or catch wrestling to help fill out the rest of your range of fight. So that's what I want to talk about today, y'all. Build on your base um, and make sure you cover the four ranges of fighting. Um, and you have a martial art that does that. All right, y'all.